Hey everybody, welcome to the Hurry Up. I am Greg Sussman. Tonight, Thursday night, football, the Miami Dolphins visit the Houston Texans, and they are big dogs in this one. The over-under sits at 44. Seven and a half point favorites are the Texans. It's the Brock Osweiler revenge game against Bill O'Brien. Gabe, what do you think? Well, I'll tell you what, Greg. We've had some pretty glamorous Thursday night uh, tilts uh, this year. This is not one of them. Uh, but as you stated, it's a Brocktober. And we're just going to ride the wave uh, right now, man. Um, let's be honest. If the Miami Dolphins and Houston Texans were playing on Sunday afternoon and there were a ton of other games going on, would this game really catch our eyes? Maybe, considering it's seven and a half points. I look at a Houston Texan football team that, you know, it's incredible that they bounce back and able to win on a weekly basis. And they've definitely saved Bill O'Brien's job uh, for now, although I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. But I also know that this is a football team that's only scored more than 20 points um, five times um, this year. And here you're asking them to lay seven and a half points. The last time they laid points in a spot like this was against the Buffalo Bills, and they barely escaped uh, with the victory. Um, you know, Brock Osweiler used to play in Houston. Can we call it a revenge game? Uh, Clowney is clowning Osweiler and saying he really doesn't remember him all that much, but he remembers that they didn't win a lot when Brock uh, was there. Now, we're not asking for the win, but we're asking for the cover. Brock's racked up some big fantasy numbers uh, in his two games. He's thrown for five uh, touchdown passes, and we're going to hope that he throws for a couple of more as we're going to take the Miami Dolphins. A little bit concerned with all the wide receiver issues. I just want to, when push comes to shove, if you're going to play this game, and I know you will if you're watching this video, you're obviously going to play in this game. You really want to be laying seven and a half points with this Houston team. Yeah, Houston keeps winning, but they're not covering a number. Number's just a little bit too lofty, and that back door will be swinging uh, all night long at uh, seven and a half. Give me the Miami Dolphins plus the points. It just seems like a lot of points in Houston for Miami. Listen, Houston's just not that good. The Dolphins, probably not that bad. I also think it's for October and they get it done game. And let me just throw something in here, too. I don't want to leave this on the table, guys. The Houston Texans, the fact of the matter is the last 11 times they've been home favorites, they've covered three of those games, all right? So it's not as though they have a track record of blowing teams out. They should blow teams out. They don't. We'll have to take the points. For Gabe Marenzi, I'm Greg Sussman. If you're betting on tonight's game, good luck, and we'll see you back here tomorrow for Gabe's picks all across the board. You do not want to miss it.